Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Elric here, your host. Now, a lot of you folks have asked for it. I know it's not actually the most newest product on the market, but it's still pretty new. This is the new OCZ. That's right, the OCZ 256 gigabyte. That's right, man, this is their Vertex 4 featuring the Indelex controller. Now, these things are really supposed to be super fast. You guys saw our reviews of the previous drives by those companies, and they've always been really fast. In fact, my research has shown that OCZ is pretty much who the enthusiasts picked overall for SSD quality. I don't know why, but hey, OCZ, you guys are doing something right because the people out there are speaking and they say they love you. So with that said, let's do the unboxing of this new drive and take a real quick look. So we got the front of the box right here. Nothing too exciting there. You guys just see the nomenclature and all that. Flip it around the back of the box. Nothing too much there either. In the front though, you can just see it's 256 gigabyte. It's important. I'll take this little tab right here on top. I don't even need a knife or anything else for this unboxing. We'll just go ahead and pop this open. Should be a standard 2.5 drive. Some of the guys last week were asking me to show how high the drive was. Now, I don't know if that's exactly on the box, if it says it. Let me see. Dun, 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 dun. Uh, nope, I don't see that information because somebody said it was for 70 and 90. I don't have that particular information, but let's go ahead and show you the package. So it's right here. I'll flip the top. Right on top here, we can see a couple things. Here's the user's manual. All that good stuff. Has the warranty information and all that stuff. Nothing too else about it. We'll get that out of there. And then it says, uh, my SSD is faster than your HDD. You guys have seen this before. This is kind of, you know, a no-brainer. Everybody knows an SSD is faster than an HDD. God, I sure hope so for the cost difference. So let's toss that out of the way. Then we're going to get to... I'll go back here in the back first. Let's remove the plate. Now, a lot of you guys said that you appreciate it when companies include this bracket. So these guys have included the bracket. Let me try to pull it out of there. There's a nice little bracket. Let me get it completely out of the package for you guys. Kaboomy kabammy. The screws also are in here. So I'll set that off to the side. Now, back here on the other top, we have the screws. They're all right here. I'll try to pull those out here. And the drive. Let me get this stuff out of here. Got to bend little stuff there. So here are all the screws you're going to need. They're all in this little tiny bag right here. So those will be able to mount your drive to the plate and the plate inside of your system, however you need that to be. And then last but not least, we get to the actual drive itself. You can see it's in a completely self-sealed anti-static bag. Brand new. I'm going ahead and break this seal. In fact, get the camera to come up here by the microphone and see if I can get a seal ripping sound here. So there we go. Nice little seal ripping sound. No special effects were used in the making of this video. That's all true, natural, live sound. Here's the drive. Kabloomy. You can see it's actually one of the thicker SSD drives. You can see the mounting holes and everything. Here's the backside. And on the backside, you can also see the power and SATA connections right there. And that's pretty much it, folks. Now, next week, I will slap this thing on a test station. So expect the full review sometime next week. And if you guys are looking for pricing on this, right now, Amazon has some excellent deals on these drives. And you guys can check out those prices in the description below. We'll see you back here on motherboards.org tomorrow.